What's up, y'all? Gordon here. I want to share something with you all that I'm, I'm finding to be true in my life. I'm finding that living a life of inspiration, right, and flow, magic, it requires a lot of letting go. Uh, it requires a lot of surrendering up what you think you know. Three weeks ago, I was certain that me and my lady was going to be moving back to Kansas City. I was certain of it. I'm like, this is what we're doing, you know. And, and so we, I mean, we were we, we moved out of our places, right? We began to sell our stuff. Uh, I was in the process of putting my car up on Facebook Marketplace, and then one day, I woke up, and because I was open. Right. Even even in my certainty, I remained open to divine guidance. One day I woke up and like uh, it's like it's like God dropped in my head. The idea that you're not going anywhere. You need to stay right here. And I saw it, I brought this up with my girlfriend and we, and we talked about it. And it turns out it was like a relief to her. She was like, oh. Okay, well, I mean, I just, I just quit my job, but, you know, uh, cool, you know. And now we're staying here on the island, and we're, we're trusting the process. And <laughs> it's so funny, man, because I was certain. I knew we were going to move back. But here we are. And... I think it's so important in life to be able to change your mind. A lot of us, I think, uh, we get attached, you know, to what we think we're going to do, what we're, or, or, or what we think we're going to become, or what we what we think we need. But if you're intending to live a life of inspiration. Right. Well, and that means you're also leaning on spirit. You're you're tapped into spirit and you're co-creating, you're collaborating with spirit. And oftentimes spirit is working in ways that your mind is not perceiving. And so you you got to put down what your mind is perceiving in order to receive what what spirit is cooking up. You know, and and I'm seeing that in my life right now, you know, uh what I thought I was going to create for myself in Kansas City, turns out I'm creating something even better for myself here right now uh, while we're, whilst we're still in Hawaii, right? We, you know, we've found, manifested a beautiful community, you know, beautiful working and living spaces, beautiful land and people. The people here are incredible, so conscious and alive and, and you know, uh, just service oriented right? it's like real community and uh it's it's better than what we were uh, let's be for myself it's better than what i was imagining you know and so yeah this is a quick video inviting you to to remain open whilst determined right and and remain remain open whilst being decided and certain because uh yeah sometimes what you think you know uh ain't got nothing on what spirit has in store for you so love y'all i'm about to get back to writing i'm writing a book right now you know, i'm about to get back to that if you if you found this useful inspiring leave a like all that good stuff and and, and just uh and just pass it on in, in, in your own unique way. Pass on the love. So, all right, y'all. Peace.